Don McLean, one of the early songs from the time of Vincent and American Pie. This one is Castles in the Air. This is a song I used to play and sing this all the time. Love the tune. Uh, we play it in a double or in a drop D tuning, not double drop D, although it could be in it. And so there's a lot of options we could do with this. And I'm thinking about putting a lesson together on this song at Totally Guitars. Which, so if you're interested in that, come over and check us out and, and uh, get a vote in on it. But just want to talk a little bit about drop D tuning and how that affects chords because it means you're going to play your no you can play a normal D chord. <laughs> But you're just going to be using the sixth string in the bass, so nothing is different with your left hand. But you're going to keep an alternating bass now going between the sixth and fourth strings. So that's what happens in drop D tuning. It does affect how you're going to play an E minor chord, and that's how they how Don gets a really distinctive sound in this. He starts off with a little melody, and but this note is hammered on the bass because in a normal a normal E minor chord we'd hit the sixth string open, but with it tuned down to D. When we play an E minor chord, we now have to play it at the second fret. So in, instead of your two fingers being on the fourth and fifth strings, let your two fingers be on the fourth and sixth strings. So they're split, and you're going to start with a hammer on to that bass note so that it gives you a little more, more time to get to it. Now that little run is then done with that hammer on to the sixth string of E minor. And just keep it alternating through it. Now when it go, now it goes to A7, and the A7 starts with a hammer on on the first string. So I like to finger that with my second finger on the fourth string at the second fret, and then my third finger doing the hammer on up on the first string. And then using your fourth finger to come in and get the B in the melody. Then it lands back on a D chord. As it gets into the verse, it starts running through D, D major 7, D6, and back to D major 7. It sounds a little bit like Gentle on My Mind, another song from the same era by John Hartford, of course made famous by Glenn Campbell. But uh, anyway, Castles in the Air. Fun song. If you'd like to uh, see more on it and make sure that I get to a lesson on it, come over to totallyguitars.com and hit the recommend a lesson button. That's a lot of how we make uh, decisions on there. We've got a top 100 list. And then, if it's not on that list, you can uh, recommend it, and you'll get on the list when it's in the top 100. Anyway, hope you can check us out very soon at totallyguitars.com.